Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in. Alessandro the Crypto here. I hope you're doing all fine. So before we're going to analyze the Bitcoin price action, just a little side note. Thank you again very much, my friends, for your support. Currently, we have many likes on every video and lots of views. So thank you very much for the support. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Moon up the likes in every video. And I very appreciate your support. So before we start with Bitcoin, my friends, currently we have Chainlink, Band and Bancor going absolutely nuts. Bitcoin is kind of boring, just trading sideways, waiting for the next big move. But what we have seen in the last couple of days here in these three altcoins makes me really believe that we are at the beginning stage of a huge bull run. And especially these three coins here, which are very important for the DeFi space, I think you should definitely keep an eye on them. And as soon as Bitcoin is going to correct, or better, if Bitcoin is going to have a huge correction, then watch out for these three coins because this you definitely don't want to miss out in your portfolio because currently they're going absolutely nuts. And if we're going to see a bigger correction, then this is definitely a good buy opportunity. No financial advice, but what we have seen in the last couple of days here, especially in these three altcoins, is really huge and is completely outperforming the other coins no matter what coin you're looking at for sure i'm also bullish on the top coiners like eos xrp litecoin ethereum and of course bitcoin but what we have seen here in the DeFi space is maybe what we had in 2016 17 with the icos so make sure that you also diversify a little bit i don't tell you to go all in into those coins but at least diversify in case of a major correction to the downside and if you have none of those coins maybe start to dca a little bit already now because of course there's a high chance that we will see a major correction anytime soon in the markets but but if we continue to pump here those coins have a very great potential to go way way higher than where we are right now so just keep that in mind my friends in case that we're gonna see a major correction on the bitcoin price because currently we're approaching to a very critical point where we're gonna see a decision here if we are breaking out now definitely from twelve thousand dollar to the upside towards our next target of 14,000 or are we gonna start here a major correction down to possibly nine to ten thousand dollar so we can have a quick look here in the one hour time frame because here you can see the wedge that we are in currently and we're still waiting here for a breakout all the moving averages are coming back here together so in case that you're looking for a long position towards the bottom here watch out for the 200 moving average in the one hour exactly at eleven thousand five hundred dollar we have currently the rsi right at the 50 level so it's really decision time right now here in the next couple of hours if we go over to the Bollinger Band here we're trading in the bearish side we're squeezing also into this channel we have currently the MACD shifted to the downside but stochastic oversold and now shifted to the upside so we have both bearish and bullish signs also that's why currently my own indicator is going nuts here in the lower time frame so you cannot count on it because we are squeezing into this channel and the best thing to do right now is just to wait here for a breakout and trade the breakout if you want to go long or short over on Bybit, Femex or Bityard. So let's go over to the four hour time frame because here is a bit more clearer where we are right now because you see the 20 moving average currently right at our new support here at 11,660. If we're going to close a four hour candle to the downside here, so below the 20 moving average, this could signal that very, very soon we're going to break out here to the downside. But since we are more fighting currently here, the resistance at around $11,800, I'm still more confident that we will see a potential breakout here to the upside. Also, we are still here in the upper area in the RSI. So even with this last couple of dumps here, we always stayed here above the 50 level in the RSI in the four hour, which is 
is a very bullish sign and this signals that the bulls are here and ready to defend here these price levels my indicator hit here a sell signal but is yet not confirmed and also to have a clear sign here to sell or buy we need to see here clear overbought or oversold condition we are right here in the middle squeezing out into this wedge and we are waiting here for a breakout most likely to the upside but there are still some warning signs that we could see a potential major correction to the downside that would take also many of these altcoins down and this is when you want to buy in and start to diversify into some altcoins if you don't have already yet and now let's switch over into the bollinger band in the four hour because also here you can see that currently we are trading in the lower part so we close now a four hour candle below the lower part here of the bollinger band so here if we're gonna fall down the target is again towards eleven thousand five hundred dollar where the 200 moving average is lining up in the one hour and also don't forget that this is the price level where we closed the cmes on friday so most likely we're gonna retrace somewhere at those levels as soon as the cmes are gonna start to trade again on monday we have here the macd shifted to the downside the stochastic here is quite in neutral condition so also here we are waiting for a potential breakout and i think there is still a high chance that we will see first 11,500 and hopefully also close the weekly candle above 11,500 if we are going down to test these levels and now let's head over into the daily time frame because here i want to show you something bullish even though here we have a bearish divergence we have a higher high in the price and a lower high in the rsi and also my indicator hit a sell signal when we had this drop towards the 20 daily moving average it looks like that bitcoin currently is forming another ascending triangle with a clear resistance at around eleven thousand eight hundred dollar so this is looking like a perfect ascending triangle and if we measure here if we're gonna break out here to the upside that would bring us towards the price level of around 13 to 14 thousand dollar so it is very likely that we're still going to reach those price levels in case of a breakout here to the upside so in the daily it looks like that we could be in this potential ascending triangle which will break out to the upside and that could be the final step before a major correction but if we're able to push through here 14,000 and also create a support above then I think it's very likely that we're gonna test $16,000 in the next couple of days so this breakout that we're gonna see here from this wedge is gonna be very significant and I think if you're gonna trade this breakout you will do a lot of nice gains so make sure that you're ready to trade this breakout we can also have a look here into the daily time frame in the bollinger band because currently we are here in theory still trading in the upper area so also here you can see we can easily go down here to test the middle line of around 10,860 but also push here higher towards 12,600 dollar which is the top of the bollinger band we have the macd here quite toppy we could see potentially a bearish cross here if we continue to trade sideways here or even drop towards 11,500 or lower and stochastic is coming into oversold condition so also here we are waiting here for this breakout from this wedge in the lower time frames before we can say if we are going up again to retest the top or are we gonna see here a major correction towards 11,500 and even lower towards 11 k and now the most important time frame the weekly because here you can see clearly that after this big green candles that we had here the rsi currently is getting into overbought condition we still have some room left to the upside also my indicator hit it here a buy signal once we tested the 20 weekly moving average but i think it is very very likely in case of a major correction that we will go down here to test potentially the 20 weekly moving average at nine thousand four hundred dollar so i think if we have a major correction at the moment these are the price targets and also these are the price levels where i would start to diversify into some altcoins as well because if bitcoin is going to correct down to this price level and also test the 20 weekly moving average also many of these altcoins that also now perform very well gonna have a major correction and this is when you have to take this buy opportunity because it could be the last time that you will find these coins so cheap 
And if we have a look in the Bollinger Band in the weekly, also here you can see that we're still overshooting here the Bollinger Band. So a correction is possible down towards the middle line here of around $9,000. We have MACD and Stochastic also shifted to the upside, but also here you see that we are in very overbought condition and this looks quite toppy. We are just waiting here for a potential bearish cross in Stochastic and MACD if we are getting rejected here at the top of the Bollinger Band, which wouldn't mean that we're going to have a big trend reversal, but at least a correction, a pullback towards the midline and then start immediately to trade again towards 12K and higher. So that's why, my friends, be ready for all scenarios and you will be fine. And if you're trading with the leverage here on Bybit, Femex or Bityard, then wait for this breakout of this wedge that we are in currently in the lower time frames, especially in the four hour and if you want to see my signals of my indicator then make sure that you sign up also to my discord trading chat the chat is completely for free everyone is welcome and of course if you have twitch you can also follow me in the live streams over on twitch so with that said guys i'm gonna wrap it up please open up a bybit femex or bityard account with the links that you find down below here in the video description you will get some sign up bonus and also support the channel if you want to trade bitcoin and other assets up to 100x leverage so even with small amounts you can do huge gains it doesn't matter if the market is pumping or dumping here you can go long you can go short in the market and you will do nice gains also with small amounts even if you are a beginner if you sign up with my links you will get some sign up bonus if you fulfill all the requirements like you have to put some deposits or do some stuff like follow them on the social medias and so on then you will get the full bonus that you see here down below in the video description because with this money you can also start to trade here completely riskless so thank you very much for watching my friends enjoy your sunday and we're gonna see us all in the next one bye